All right, guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you a little party trick that I learned back in middle school, and that is how to take 12 nails and balance them right on top of this nail, just like this. No, just kidding, that's terrible. But I'm gonna show you how to do it for real. So, first off, hammer a nail into a board. Make sure it's sticking up as straight as possible. Uh, I have 12 nails here. Um, some of them are bent, not really a big deal, but you wanna make sure you take the straightest of the two nails to start. I'm gonna put one of those nails aside. I'm gonna take the other one, I'm gonna lay it down flat, right on the bench here. I'm then going to lay the remaining 10, 10 nails on top of this nail, making sure that the head of the nail is resting uh, on the nail that's laying down. And I'm gonna lay these nails in an alternating fashion, just like this. Make sure you leave enough room. And there you go. So five nails on each side, alternating each uh, direction each time. And uh, the next step is to take the other straight nail that you chose and you're going to lay it down on top. Now the first nail that you put down, the head of the nail is on this side. You wanna make sure that the head of the nail of this last nail is on the opposite side. Uh, before I go any further, in order to do this, you need nails that have uh, a head that's of decent size. So you wouldn't be able to use like a finished nail or something like that. Lay it down on top. Okay, here's the trickiest part of the whole thing. Um, first off, when you pick this whole apparatus up, and place it on top of this, you need to make sure it's centered. If it's not centered, it's just gonna fall off. The other part is, these nails that are on the side here sticking out are gonna wanna fall down. And when they do wanna fall down, this top nail is gonna wanna rise up a little bit. So you're gonna wanna allow that top nail to rise up. And when it rises up, it needs to rise up evenly, not on one side or the other, all right? Or else the nails will fall out. So carefully pick it up off the bench, making sure you're keeping those top and bottom nails as tight together as possible you'll see the nail start to fall down a little bit. As you place this on top of your other nail, make sure that top nail raises up evenly as you let go slowly. And if everything's balanced correctly, boom, there you go. 12 nails on top of one nail, all right? If you can master this party trick, you will be the talk of the town, rich and famous. If you fail at this trick, you'll be ridiculed, tarred and feathered, your picture will be posted across the town for you to be pointed and laughed at for years to come. Master that trick.